The goal today is to knock these down, sand it real nice and smooth, and get it ready for primer. Most of these imperfections here on the very edge, um, for example, on the mirror cover as well. The reason we wanna sand these down is because eventually you're gonna see this bleed right through the clear coat. We'll start off with 320, we'll sand it with the DA. Um, the reason I'm gonna use an orbital sander is it cuts a little more aggressive and that's what I'm looking for. Once we prime it, then I'll sand it by hand. If we use an orbital sander in this area, it'll probably tear the foam that's on this base. We wanna mask it off to protect any damage from the orbital sander. For this, I'm gonna use a 3M fine line. I'm gonna outline it with this one, and then I'll come back over with yellow masking over it so that it doesn't affect the foam. What people forget to do is the orbital sander will skip the edges because it balances too much on the edges. So by hand, we will have to do a lot of these edges that the orbital sander actually missed. Primer, um, it's by PPG. It's an Enviro, Enviro base primer, and uh, the mixing ratio is four to one. So essentially, it takes four parts of primer, one part of the activator. I know some colors, some base coats are high metallics. It's always recommended to leave on a uh, shaker for more than 30 minutes. But, you know, if you don't have a shaker, stir it. Put the liner in a hard cup. This is called a tack rag. The purpose of the tack rag is to wipe 
the objects that you're about to prime paint um, to remove any debris left behind from prior cleaning, walking in and out of the booth, or just any movement around the object. One of the ways I typically guide coat is I'll use aerosol, any black aerosol. The reason I'm using aerosol on these objects, they're so small so that when I grab these objects, I don't want to smear my guide coat. And the purpose of applying the guide coat, it's not to cover the complete surface in black, but just to smoke it to where you can still use the gray and the black to see what you're doing.